Hey everyone, I'm Dave, another nerdy Canuck, and I'm uh, just bringing my first video about my solar panels. I would have loved it to have been more descriptive of the system itself, but unfortunately we're doing some troubleshooting right now, so you have to bear with me. Uh, just to give you a quick overview, I do have, uh, I believe there's 43 or 46 panels, and they're arranged in three strings. I can show you the logical layout. So we have three strings of panels. And I have the top right and the bottom are south-facing panels, and then I have some east-facing panels and some west-facing panels. Anyway, the problem that I've been running into is as of about, let's go to the previous month, uh, you can see that starting about the 25th of November, my solar production has stopped, and uh, they've been doing some troubleshooting for me. And you can see that I have some solar production being created as of today, a little bit yesterday and some today, the 12th. So it's been a bright sunny day all day long, but unfortunately the solar system keeps tripping off. So let's just dive right in and have a look. You'll see that I have a screen capture on the left of my phone app, and it's going to identify when the solar system is producing power and not. And then we have a video on the right of the actual solar edge error lights. Now the primary purpose of this video is for the solar edge people to do some troubleshooting. So I'm just gonna let a couple of these errors run in real time so they can see the error codes and the lack of power production. And then I'm going to accelerate the port second portion of this video so that they can uh, kind of see how often this is happening. So you'll uh, see a couple of different things happening throughout, throughout the day. So right now I'm charging my electric car and I am also cooking a turkey dinner for Christmas. And uh, towards the end of this video, there is neither the car charging or the turkey dinner being cooked. And I have a more typical usage and it seems to happen all the time. Now it does sometimes go for a longer period of time. So uh, right at the beginning here, it's actually tripping off and starting up again very quickly. I'm not sure what these flashing lights mean, but I'm hoping that the solar edge people can help out with that. And you'll see that it goes green and blue and I start producing power. And then as soon as I get up to full production, which is about six or so kilowatts with the sun where it is, then the light's going to go red and it's going to trip off. Now, sometimes it produces power for a slightly longer period of time. It all depends on, uh, I don't know what, but it just kind of goes and then you'll see you get the red light and then the green one flashes and power production goes out and then it just repeats over and over again. So uh, the only difference really is how long it's actually producing power before the solar system trips off. So as far as I know, there's nothing weird or unusual going on. Uh, you can see my power draw right now is just from the electric car charging and the stove is not uh, heating at the moment but when the stove does kick on you'll see that it jumps up a little bit more to about uh, 14 or 15 kilowatts anyway what i'm going to do at this point is i'm going to stop talking i'm going to speed up the video to about 30 times so it's going to move much more quickly and uh, this same basic process repeats itself i didn't go through and verify but i'm pretty confident that the uh, lighting and the error codes are all similar all the way through. Thanks very much. Cheers.